Hello my Sparries, Keisha Simsima and today we will be doing a new video so if you are new to my channel, if, it's your first, if it is your first time to my channel please 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 go ahead and subscribe you will be missing a lot if you don't I know some of my videos may not look too great but I promise you it's gonna get better and so if you are always stopping by my channel welcome 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 back and today I have a continuation of my last video which is my accessories thrift all today I will be showing you some great stuff some designer stuff and if you want to see what I have to show you stay tuned so guys today first of all I just want to um, comment on the elephant in this room which is my lips I was just trying out a lip color I probably should have lined it it dried too quick so I didn't get the chance to do that but that's okay where am I going nowhere and second thing, you may have seen this ad on my um, first part of my accessories all, and you know. If you haven't seen that video, it will be a link below so you can watch it. And my shirt, I am so loving it. I thrifted it also, and it says God's country. Yes, it is his country. It is his world. That's my belief. It's not. If it's not yours, then that's okay. Okay? And secondly, I'm about to show you something that I just got from AliExpress. I believe it's a sunglass. I'm not sure, but I just figured since I got it today, why not throw it into my haul and show you guys. It's not thrifted. It's from AliExpress. So I'll show you guys. Stay. So you guys, this is the package that I received today from Ali. It looks like some sunglasses. I've ordered a lot. I normally order a, some of those colorful stuff, especially during the summer. I like to like get a little bit colorful. So this is what it is. Ooh, yes, it is. It must be. This is the wipe that you use to clean your glasses. And let's see what's inside. My lightning is not as bright as how I want to. I'm trying to use the light. Oh, this. Oh my gosh. How about we just try it on? So this is the glasses. <laughs> Let's try it on. I have this nice yellow shirt that I've ordered. And as I said in previous of my previous videos, yellow. Look at it. It's so pretty in the inside. So I think I told myself that yellow this year, this summer, this spring is going to be especially once it starts getting a little bit lighter right now, the spring. I don't even know if we have spring, but. Anyways, let's try this on and see how it looks. Oh my gosh, everything outside. Everything outside is pretty, it's sunny. I should wear this. I should wear this all the time right now since it's, there's no sun. And there's hardly any sunlights. And the winter scene is as if it's not, it's like prolonging. So this will make me believe in my brain that there's sun outside. And because everything just seems yellow and sunny. And I think this is a beautiful glass. I love it. It's clash with my lipstick. It will look better with nude. Yeah, no, that's the elephant. But yeah, this is my glasses. I really, really love it. I'm glad I purchased it. There's different colors such as red, pink, but I wanted the yellow so bad. Probably order more. But yeah, this is it that I wanted to show you guys. So I'm going to put this away and enough of that. It's enough of the chit chat. We're going to get into our um, thrift accessory all and I'm excited to show you guys. So stay tuned. So guys, as you are all aware, those that always follow me that I do majority, majority, like 95, no, 98, 99% of my shopping at Talese. Oh my gosh, and this is a lot of stuff. And guys, I already showed you a bunch of stuff that I have um, thrifted in my first part of my haul. But this is a bag that I really want to show you guys. It is um, from the brand Cal Calvin Klein. I noticed that they still do have this in store and it's, it's been selling for $1.99 plus tax. And I will link the name, link the um, link the name of the bag, whatever it's called, and the I'll put a link where you can get this in a regular store. But I thrifted this one, and as I said, it was um, for it's Calvin Klein, and it was um, it's retail for one ninety nine, and I got it for fourteen dollars and ninety nine cents. And I have been taking this to work with me, so that's why it's a little bit heavy because it has like my glasses, my wallet, papers, and makeup, and those kind of stuff. So I'll do like what's in my bag. So I will do what's in my bag and show you guys whatever I have in my bag next time. And so, yes, we're going to go into our strip. I know, I know, you're rushing me, but I'm excited as you are. And I just want to say the best. I'm excited as you guys are also, and I just want to leave the best for last. So the first one, this makeup bag. Hopefully you guys can see it. I need for it to be focused. It says makeup power. No, powerful makeup. Oh my gosh. So it says powerful makeup. I hope you guys can see it. And I paid $1.99 for it. It's by Derma Blank Professional. I think it may have I think it may have came with like a gift set, but it's pretty new inside, never been used, and I think it's cute. I'm not sure what I want to do with it. I really don't want to get makeup in it and mess it up, so I probably just wear it like the rest bag. 
yeah, when I'm not bringing a lot of stuff, that's what I think I personally will be doing with it. The second bag, guys, that I want to show you is this bag here. It is the coach bag. If you do follow me on Instagram, I will link my Instagram name below. I've changed my Instagram name recently, so I will link the new name below so you guys can see it. I'll stop this in it so you can crack it up a little bit keep the, um, to keep the shape, but I don't know if it's it. So I think it's a very cute. It's Again, if it's somewhere, I'm going somewhere and I just need to bring like uh, my wallet and my phone, I think this is perfect for it. And it's in the brand Coach, and I believe I ripped the tag off of it. I've never used it before, but I ripped the tag because it was hindering me from opening the bag, so I ripped it off. It was right here and so I ripped the tag off and I believe this bag was uh, it cost me $12.99 and it is authentic authentic guys yes it is is it yeah I think so probably not but it's cute <laughs> it is not authentic funny but it's cute though it says made in China I don't know I think it's pretty cute and I'll still wear it like yeah and the third one, and I'm not going to keep track of counting, as I said in my previous video, because I do purchase a lot of stuff, and if I continue counting, you might think that I don't know how to count. So, let's get into the other one. So, the other one, you guys, is this perfect little bag. So, it's like a watch bag, or it's for, like, either watch, some form of jewelry. I have this cute necklace. Necklace. I'm not sure. Hopefully, I have it in the back to show you guys. It's from Guess, that I also got from Telly's. And I think this bag is so cute. I'm going to keep my jewelry. I have a lot of, like, chokers and stuff that I want to protect and here's the inside it's all clean i like this thing that they have there so we keep my jewelry from tarnishing because i have a little bit of small stuff that i want to store inside here and you close it like this it's i guess and it was for two dollars and 99 cents and the other one that i have here guys this one i honestly did not purchase this at talise this one i got at i think it was Goodwill. No, Salvation Army. I got this one at Salvation Army. I honestly could not shop at Salvation Army. I'm sorry, I'm not going to beat them up for those who that shop there. But their stuff are so old. And just some of the stuff then that people give for like donation, it's like, why don't you just throw it out? Throw it out the garbage. Like, who's going to wear that? If you're, like, I don't know. But I have, I don't think I'll ever go back there. Probably it's just that one location. But this was something that I found there. And it's by the, it's like a, it came with a perfume set. or, And it's by the brand Dior, Christian Dior. So I got this. I thought it was cute. I wanted an organizer for my bag because my stuff is all over the place. Um, this is how it looks inside. They have never used it before. And yeah, I'm just going to use it as a form of something to organize all the papers and stuff that I have in my bag so it can, you know, like not all over the place. And it's easier to find my keys or even throw my keys inside here so I know exactly where to find it when I'm looking for it. So this is this one. And guys, the other thing that I found is this perfect, perfect bag. I know you guys are going to love it. It's this perfect bag. Perfect. It's so perfect. It's like a sandy creamish nudish color and i know i will be wearing this a lot hopefully you guys can see the name it's Cade space skate space oh my gosh oh my gosh i hope she's not watching this video it is by kate spade kate spade i don't know why i'm putting s's on so this is how it's locked as you can see you turn it like this and this is how it's opened and this is the inside of it pretty 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 I believe it's brand spanking new. I'm not sure why whomever had this got rid of it, but th this is what I'm talking about. If you're getting rid of stuff that is barely every, you know you're not using, you have it in your closet for a few months and you know you won't be able to, you're not planning on using it, so, and you decided to donate it to the thrift store, this is something that I can say, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Like, people like me will treasure something like that, but don't donate your ripped stuff, your stuff that's all bleached out, your stuff, you know, like, even, like ripped stuff, not stuff that's distressed because of style, just don't do that. And this one, the price was for $59.99, and I could not give it up because I'm pretty sure even if it's on sale, I would probably get this for $120 on sale at a regular price. I probably would get it for, yeah, um, like probably $160-ish, between $160, $180. And I think it's, yeah, I think I, I still did great. And I love it. So into some other stuff before, like some knickknacks before I get into some of the bigger stuff. I just wanted to show you the small things first. Um, I got this Mary Kay. It's really cute it's like a mirror oh my gosh I hope there's no form of reflection anywhere but it's this cute mirror and it has this thing that you can stand it up you can put it look I think it's cute because then it has here where you put this inside let me show you guys okay. yeah so you put it inside and you have it stand like this oh my gosh and it's just stand like this so if you're doing your makeup you can have like your lipstick or your little stuff if you want to keep it here so it's easy to access and also, um, you know, you can up, down, especially when you're doing your eyebrows. That's a fun reason why I buy it to do my eyebrows or if I'm, whatever I'm doing, I start doing my makeup tutorial. And trust me, it won't look like this. But 
yeah, that's what this is for. So I'm gonna put it back together, put it back into its package. Oh, I didn't say how much I paid for it. This one was purchased at Telly's and I got it for 99 cents. So the other one that I have is this rabbit, <laughs> yours kind of head bag, and head bad. Oh my gosh, head bad, ban, head ban, <laughs> the color pink. And um, I think it's very cute for whenever I'm doing my makeup tutorial. I can use it to pull my hair back, like what the professional does. So yes, I can use it to pull my hair back, and it's pretty cute, pretty 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 cute. And yeah, I've been if you notice that in a couple of my videos, I've been rocking a lot of these stuff a lot because I love them keeps my hair looking like it's perfect when it's not and this is I paid a dollar 49 for it and I purchased this one at the Talese store the other thing that I got guys are these cards I am a huge card player I love to play cards I really don't know how to play well I know how to match my cards it's the deck of cards and I really like it I think it's cute I think it's a vintage looking and I just had to grab it and um, yeah look at it I can show you how it looks the back the front and there's like two sets of deck cards so I know I will be using it I'm not gonna take everything out and have it spilled but this is how it looks and I think it's the cutest thing ever I could not leave it and I don't have the price on it I don't remember how much I paid for it but looking at this as a telly shopper I would say I probably paid three dollars and ninety nine cents for it the other thing that I have here guys is this Louis Vuitton this, oh, why did I make that cat noise? Because I'm excited. I can't wait, wait to wear this. I can't wait to wrap it over my head, use it as a wrap on my head. I just can't, I just can't, I just can't. Yes, but I have this Louis Vuitton. Nice. Nice, 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 nice tired. When I have something as nice as this, it makes me want to speak Jamaican. So, something like this is very nice and I like it. I can use it to tie my head. I can use it as a scarf. Oh, I can, if I want to look bougie, yeah. So, especially, I know for like um, the spring, wearing like jeans, white t-shirt, and I want to look bougie, I just kind of use it like this, and I'm off I go, and there's this bougie girl with her Louis Vuitton um, scarf around her neck. If I want to do something other than that, I can use it and tie my head with it. So, it's going to be fun using it, guys. I know you love it. I know you love it. I can see you smiling. Yes, you do. And how much I paid for this was $4.99. Okay, guys, so the other knickknacks that I have continue is this brand new guess necklace it's like a sweater necklace and as i said that little guest bag that i showed you guys earlier i will be keeping stuff like my little jewelry like this that i don't want to get tarnished too quick so i will be yeah storing this little bad boy into it and i really like it i don't remember how much i paid for it i don't believe it's a lot again i will say i probably paid 4.99 for 3.99 for it and it's a little guess um, necklace. It's a sweater necklace. And I know that I will be wearing it quite a lot. The other knickknack that I have is this vintage Gucci sunglasses. Again, if you follow me on Instagram, you will see a picture that I post of it. It's authentic. It does have the serial number in there. It's almost like coming off. So you might not be able to see it properly. So that's how I could tell that it's authentic. It's an older kind of Gucci glasses as well. For two ninety nine, why would I leave it? I paid two total. Uh, I paid two dollars and ninety nine cents for it, and this is how it looks. <laughs> Do I look like Ray Charles? Uh, I feel like Ray Charles right now. But when I jazz up my hair, I will be wearing this in the summer. Turning to the side, look at my Gucci, Gucci, Gucci. Actually, I like it. I do like it. So I will be wearing this again in the summer when I want to go really dark, right? My next one is this Jennifer Hudson CD. I know, I know people don't use CD anymore because now you can use your Google Home or your Alexia, whatever it's called, your Amazon thingy thingy, whatever they called it, and says, Alexia, please play Spotlight by Jennifer Hudson. And there you go. But some people like me like vintage stuff. Yeah. I just want to pop this in my seat, in my car, in my vehicle when I'm driving in the summer down the road and I want to feel like bopping my head and getting my groove on and just want to play my music by Jennifer Hudson because there's some music on there that I really, really, really like so I could not give it up. And I believe I paid $3.99. Yeah, I've been seeing a lot of $3.99, right? But yeah, that's how much I really paid for it. I, don't, I do not really go over $4.99 or unless I truly, truly, truly like it. The other thing I have is this book. Many of you here in the States may not, well, I'm not in the state. I'm in Canada, but I know a lot of people in the state may not like her what i don't know i just figure i cannot dislike people because you cannot make them you have to learn to love but 
I got this book that she wrote, What Happened, and this book was written after the election with her. And, um, you know, she, she talked about the election, to talk about her husband and, you know, the cheating thing that went on. She talked about a lot. No, I did not read it. I just listened to a few, one for interview about it, and I saw it at the least. And how much I got for it? $3.99. And I just wanted to keep it as a souvenir and just keep it in my library. So, yeah, that's it. And on to the others that I have to show you guys is this belt. I really love it. I have a habit of um, repeating things a lot, which may be annoying to you guys because in this way I would say I really, really, really love it. <laughs> but I do love it a lot. I think it's cute. I love the front buckle, buckle there. And I, I just think it's cute and it looks very vintage. Very vintage. It looks very vintage. It's like, it's my style. It's my style. You know, I think it looks cute around the jeans, even a dress if you want to, you know, make it seem as if you have a waistline you can just use it to accentuate your um your waistline and this is by the brand where can i find it you know i've seen seen it before it's by the brand and klein i'm not sure if you guys can see it it's engraved into the belt so it's um in the size medium to large and it fits me perfectly so yeah i really really like it because of the vintage look i think it will look cute with dark blue jeans and yeah I will be wearing this a lot too. Guys, I also got this bracelet from Talese. It says 925, meaning that it is um, sterling silver. It's like um, a Tiffany. Oh my gosh, my hands are so dry. Oh my gosh, oh my god, I'm so sorry. My hands are so dry. I just came in and I washed my hands and it's so dry. I should have lotion it. I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to take a break and lotion it. But yeah, this is how it looks on the hand. It is, they said it's sterling silver. I'm not sure if it is real or not, but it's like a Tiffany. I've seen some Tiffany bracelet at Talese and I don't know if they're real or not. There's no way for me to tell. It does say um, 925, which means sterling silver. Um, there was some that is, was quite expensive. This one I paid $7.99. There was some other ones that they had that actually says Tiffany on it. And they were like um, $29.99. No, I'm lying. $24.99. And I didn't want it to take the chance, which is still cheap for Tiffany. But I just didn't want it to take the chance and it's not real and it changed and I just wasted my $25. But... Hopefully, hopefully, whoever that per whoever purchased that Tiffany will enjoy it. Okay, so um, on to some other stuff. It's the same accessories as I said, guys. Be patient, be patient. It is a long one, and I wanted to show it all to you guys before I start using them because I need to clean these bad boys up and then start getting, start getting bougie, 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 uh, bougie, uh, bougie. So guys, I just went and lotioned my hands, so now it looks a little bit presentable, and I'm coming to the end of my video, so. My nails are so yellow, oh my gosh. I want to get my nails done, but I do hair, like, part-time and mostly braiding and stuff like that. And I find, like, when my nails is done, it get wrecked easily and it's just a waste of money. So I don't bother to do it, but I love to see when your hands are done nicely. I, uh, I don't know, I try buying my own nail polish and do it, but after a while, it starts chipping off and it looks weird. And enough about my nails, let's get into... I always sidetrack, right? Let's continue back with this thrift haul. And... Guys, so the other bag that I have here is this bag. I was so excited, honestly. This is by Lum Long Champ. I used to I used to call it Lum Champ, which is an old time. Um, uh, what's the word? Like, if you guys are in my age group, so in your thirties and your early forties, you should know what I'm talking. Lamb chop the song that doesn't end. Yes, it goes on and on, my friend. Some people started singing it not knowing what it was, and then con and then continue singing it forever just because it is a song that, yeah, yeah, lamb chop. <laughs> so I've been calling this bag lamb chop, and on, I went there and I saw it. This bag is I saw it online. I posted again on my um my Instagram. Hmm. my Instagram account I post it there and when I search it up on the web this bag is cost it the retail price for it is $150 and I got it for a dollar ninety-nine. can you believe that like yeah like honestly honestly I got one like this and it's like a blush color but I will show you guys next time I should have brought it in, in this all but because I didn't I bought it a few months ago and I've used it once I was thinking of using this as my lunch bag to go to work, but I don't know. I just don't know. I am, like, I can't believe I got it for $1.99. Again, $1.99. And it is worth, like, $150. That's basically $148 saving. Like, honestly. And it's, yeah, it needs a little bit of 
love but it's not too bad it has been used but it's not bad it's really not bad so i've been talking a lot about that bag so let's get to the other one so here go my other bag goes my other bag i got this i've been looking for a coach bag like this for about a year now at a reasonable price i should say i've came across a few of them but mm, not so much of a good price as this i've seen one the other day that i truly really like but it was double this price and i decided i'll wait and i'm so happy i did this is authentic yes it is it has the serial number there if you can see that and it's pretty clean inside it's gotten warm you can see that it has been warm a little bit not a lot the bottom especially they probably Put it down on dirty desk or floor or but it's yeah it's really good quality and i have i've thrifted um running shoes in the same color so i thought that this would be perfect especially in the summer to wear or to you know like just hang out with friends or whatever going out for dinner and you know i love these um that jewelry thing on the side of it that says coach it's just all coach up so i really like it this one i paid again you can see uh it was purchased at Talese and I paid $14.99. And I think that's great for a coach bag. This probably you can get at the coach store for between $150 and $199. That's what they're basically going for. Yeah. Yeah. These ones. Because these are the old fashioned ones. Guys, I've also picked up this coach wrist bag. And I do have a coach, another coach running shoes. And it's like in the color blue. It's not like that. It's, just, it's not like It's just regular black, I believe, blue coach running shoes the newer ones so it does not all, have all these cc all over the place but it does have a lighter blue c on it at the side of it and i i just think this would go cute with it especially when i'm not i just don't want to go too with too much so yeah so this is the inside of it it is so nice i really like it it's just like a wallet it's just like if i'm taking the case to the park i could just grab it and go if i just want to have just go light or see you know i'm going somewhere i just wanted to bring a few dollars with me and my little phone yeah, I believe my phone can fit in it. I believe, not sure. But, and I love this little cute blue jewel. I don't know what to call it, but on the side here, I love that. The fact that it not only have the brown seas, it also have a dash of blue, pink, red, and green. So it goes with all different color. So yeah, I think it's my little perfect little wrist bag. We'll be having lots of fun with this. So, on to the other one.